right. <coughs> Excuse me. Those are all the guys who clean at the end of the night. Ah, Alaka Theater as well. Welcome all, how are you? For those of you who are new here, welcome to the Insanity we do on Monday nights. Those of you who've done it before, wow, you are tolerant people. Not gonna lie, not gonna lie. This is it though. I don't know if you know this, I don't know if you've looked at the calendar, but this is, this is the last Monday we get to spend together in 2014. This is it. I don't know if you've had a great year, big cheer, right? And if you've had a, you're, it's over after this week, man. I now see what camp we're in, good. I just, I just feels like a massive flashback. I'm, I'm way back. I would like to shout out that uh, Brett Kerr will be running Sound and Tech tonight. Our Thomas Jefferson fell ill with a case of zombie plague. We put a pike in his head and he should be back next week. Um, that said, we're going to probably be really rough. And I'm saying this both to you and to the internet for lots of apologies sake. Brett? talking. Sorry. You want me to say? I, yeah. Brett, I was going to do the show. As you can see, there's a bit of uh, a participation element that's really good around here. Sometimes it's good or sometimes you participate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. <laughs> Half the crew was like, never thought to ask. <laughs> Other half the crew's like, no, please stay. Please. Our egos need it. Our egos need it. Uh, this is the time of year. I don't know how you handle your end of year, uh, usually probably with a lot of strong lighting to keep the seasonal effect disorder away. Uh, but I get real introspective. You know, I know a lot of people are thinking resolutions. I'm figuring out what the hell happened. That's, that's sort of how my year goes. I go, what just happened? Okay, and I start thinking about it. And I, I stumbled on, because this is, again, it's resolution time, which is that moment where we all decide, I'm, I'm going to do this thing that has nothing to do with me, and I'm, in a month, I'm gonna stop doing that. Or I'm gonna stop doing this thing that is a core fundamental thing in my personality that would take much more work than simply stopping to correct. Those seem to be the two categories that we, we blow it on with resolutions. I have figured out the ultimate piece of advice. If you would like to take on a challenge for yourself, I have the answer. I'm gonna give, give you the greatest idea ever. You wanna hear it? Yeah. Good, good, because otherwise this would just be me talking to myself for a few minutes. I already know, so what's the point? I, I hereby grant you permission to suck. One innuendo, room ruined. There you go. I give you permission to suck, and the reason I tell you this is that every time I try to learn something by walking in very seriously, taking it like an important thing with a plan and a very, I, I didn't do it. And every time I went, eh, I suck at this, and it's fun. I learned things, I grew as a person, um, my pants grew, I mean, just things started happening. The other side of this is, if you don't have a thing you're working on, and it becomes the thing you start on. I, this year, this coming year, in about a month, I'm gonna be standing on a stage that I'm terrified of. I'm gonna be uh, a character in our very first narrative circus story. It's called Almost Five, and it scares the heck out of me because I'm, I'm gonna get up on stage and I'm not gonna be me, I'm gonna be, and I'm gonna be in this thing and I have to get it all right. I can't suck. And so I try to find this sort of safety valve in finding other projects, little things that I'm allowed to be terrible at. Most people are thinking, oh, like this, got it. Knowing quiet response. Hi. Hi. How are you? Oh, good. good. I was okay. Yeah, no, no, no. Oh, thanks. <laughs> you snuck. You like a ninja, man. If I hadn't said something, they would have just seen you. The ginger ninja. Ginger ninja. Ginger ninja. Hey, that's our word. You can't use that. You should submit that to Marvel Comics. You're obviously a fan. I don't know what he's talking about. <laughs> you know, I just took now. Wow, it's very pale. <laughs> I'll turn the other cheek. You already did. Anyway, like I said, and you missed this part, and I can't believe you weren't here for this. I just granted the entire room permission to suck. You two need to meet before the evening's out. <laughs> right. So is consent, I'd like to add. And not doing things on camera that you'll regret. Yeah. 
too late. In the meantime, like I said, uh, I give myself a lot of permission to do things badly, which fortunately is my job description, because I'm a clown. Uh, for the rest of you guys, it is a really good outlet for getting better at things, because you end up not taking them so damn seriously. Try to find the fun in things, otherwise you're doomed. Get the general idea? Tonight, you're going to see people stumble up onto this stage, and we're going to do all of their tech really badly. But they're going to stumble up on stage, you're going to see them be really good at stuff. I guarantee you, if you take five minutes and ask them, they're going to say, when I started, I sucked. And they had fun with it, and they enjoyed it, and they had a passion for it. And that's how they got good. So please, take part in that, and take part in this. All right? Fantastic. Welcome to the open stage.